I did it. Not really. Oh, here we go. You've never seen how it's done. Turn that camera off. We're about to learn how you do it. Hello, and we're coming at you with another installment of SLS Drift Taxi. This right here is the lovely and modest Olga. Hi. How are you? I'm great. What happened yesterday that you're feeling so good today? I was on a 24-hour shift. A 24-hour shift? You work at a zoo? Yes. Who looks after the bears? I don't know. Can you just tell me where you work? I'm an administrator. That's all you're getting out of me. Ah. Webcam studio? No? Yeah. Close, but not exactly. How can a guy seduce you in five minutes? Me? Yes. There's no way. No way? How much time does it take to court you? A month. A month? At least. At least a month? At least a month. So they'd be like, hi, and do that for a whole month. For the whole month. Of course. I thought you could say hi and uh, on the 31st, like you're mine. Doesn't work that way? So you're all about flowers, chocolates, dominoes. When do you let someone go in for a kiss? In a month. Are you serious? I am. And so they chase you for a month. Round and round. Aren't you hard to get? Have you ever been out drifting? Maybe you have a favorite driver? I don't keep track. Do you have a license? <laughs> oh, you had one. It was revoked? Oh, you bought it. Okay, what car do you drive? I had a Mitsubishi Pajero Sport. Oh, that sounds sporty. Why did you say had? I sold it. Okay, so you didn't total it. No. Did you do drifting in the winter? It's too big and unruly for that. So you don't like big ones? <laughs> I like big cars. All right, that'll do. Have you ever been out drifting with anybody? Okay, and what do you think? It wasn't too frightening. I think this will be. Why are you winding yourself up? I'm a gentle dude. Wanna see for yourself? Sure. And we're off to test the statement. SLS drift taxi, turn the volume up. You didn't put your camera gear back there, did you? Wouldn't want to crush anything. Okay, so you've been out. Why is it scary? You don't like going fast? I think this will be more intense. So you administrate 24 hours of work and then 48 off. It varies. When someone gets lost? That's one way to put it. And that's when you come in. And you're used to it? It's been a year. It has to have some benefits. But you must have a nagging feeling come the evening. I myself used to do the 24-hour shifts, and evening time is the worst. You're sitting there thinking everybody's having fun. Oh, for you, that's when things just start to get fun. Sounds like you have an interesting job. Why not share? You too shy? I work at an erotic massage place, okay. <laughs> Interesting enough for you? Of course. Hello there. And it's all like, whoa. Got any funny stories? 
Like something that happened recently. Not really. I take it it's mostly slightly drunk dudes that visit you. Sometimes they're sober. You've got diehards. Sometimes it's young dudes, older men. Sometimes. They need help going to the bathroom. I think it's time to head out. You and your... You holding on? Fist bump? That was all right. <laughs> that was all right? I didn't even scream. Did you want to? Not really. Why so? That was all right. I was trying my best. It means you have to keep trying. Aren't you a... Show me how a pro does it. Oh, you are such a tease. Of course. Not even a tiny bit of fear? Just a bit. <laughs> That's a good sign. <laughs> Massage place. Massage place. How many girls you got working there? Do they enjoy it? You talk to them, right? It's all about the money. Some of them enjoy it, so they're in it for the money. Only cash, no love. What are you talking about? I'm just gonna say it as it is. But I don't think that jerking off random guys every day is an enjoyable activity. I mean, I never specifically asked. So I really wouldn't know. But you talk to those guys. I milk them for money. So that's what you do. I'm not giving you a dime. We'll see about that. Okay, now I'm scared. <laughs> Let's go. Let's. Was that better? <laughs> that was better. Thank you. Round of applause. Thank you. You smell that? I like it. Not like at work. Unfortunately, no. That's not it. I don't like that you weren't screaming. I thought I would be swearing. Well, why hold yourself back? You didn't make that strong of an impression on me. Didn't get you to the spot. You'll have to wait a month. <laughs> right! Okay, you want to tell me how that felt? You weren't yelling or swearing, and here I am waiting for it to happen. I'm sorry, but you just weren't up to it. Oh, come on. It was almost at 90 degrees out there. The second time around was much better. Second time is always better. We're talking about drifting. I realized that. <laughs> Which bit did you enjoy the most? The transition, maybe? I don't know about any of that. So first we were accelerating, heading for the fence, then we initiated, we made the curve, switched, and kept going. The switch part. So you like flipping? Sure. There's a bunch of interesting stuff that we filmed in the interior, I think. I mean, we have some interior shots. But I'm guessing you've already seen all of it if you've gotten this far into the video. You got anything to say to the viewers? <laughs> Go ahead, say something. 
Subscribe to the channel, like, comment. Aren't you the emotional one? Here is Olga's Instagram. Subscribe, check out her photos. Anything there from work? I guess I should subscribe and have a look. Really? No? Oh, I'd be all over at doing stories or live broadcasts. Okay, I'll do some stories. Here's my Instagram, where I also record stories, though my line of work is slightly different. Here we have the SLS Drift Taxi Instagram. Make sure to hit that notification bell so that you don't miss the next video we put out. Like and comment. That'll keep us motivated to put new stuff out. Bye, everybody. Goodbye.